Hello everyone, in this video we are solve this interesting math question. Uh, obviously it is interesting because of that here is big number. So this question is x squared plus x is equal to 4, 4, 4, 4, 2, 2, 2, 2. And we'll find out what is the value of x in this exponential equation. So how to solve this question? Uh, first of all, I can see easily it is a quadratic equation. So at this moment, I can say this equation becomes, look, here is x squared plus x. So I can say x squared plus x. And if I move on this term in this side, so I can see easily it will be minus 4, 4, 4, 4. And here is 2, 2, 2, 2 is equal to 0. So at this moment, I can see easily it is a big number. So I can say this number is 4, 4, 4, 4, 2, 2, 2, 2 is equal to, it will be <coughs> 4, 4, 4, 4 times, I can see easily, times 1, 0, 0, 0, 0 plus 2, 2, 2, 2. So in this case, I can say this times this plus this, it will be this number. So at this moment, I can say easily, here is uh, 4, 4, 4, 4. It will be 4 times 1, 1, 1, 1. And here is uh, 10,000. It will be 9, 9, 9, 9 plus 1. And it will be... 2, 2, 2, 2. Then I can see easily it will be 4 times 1, 1, 1, 1. And in this case, I can see easily here is 9, 9, 9. It will be 9 times 1, 1, 1, 1 plus 1 plus. And in this case, I can see it will be 2 times 1, 1, 1. So at this moment, uh, let here is 1, 1, 1. It will be A. So let 1, 1, 1, 1 is equal to A. So in this case, I can see easily it will be 4A times 9A plus 1. And here is 2A. Because of that, 1, 1, 1, it will be A. Then I can see easily it will be 4 times 9. It will be 36. And a times a, it will be a squared plus 4a times 1, it will be 4a plus here is 2a. Then this equation becomes, look, here is 36a squared plus 6a. Then I can see easily, here is 6a is common, so it will be 6a plus 1. So we will find out here is 4. 4, 4, 4, 2, 2, 2, 2, it will be 6a times 6a plus 1. But remember that our question is x squared plus x minus this big number. So I can see easily it will be <coughs> our question is x squared plus x minus 4, 4, 4, 4. 2, 2, 2, 2 is equal to 0. Then in this case, I can see easily uh, it will be x square plus x minus, and in this case, we know that this number it will be 6a times 6a plus 1 is equal to 0. Then <coughs> I can see easily uh, here is x square plus and in this case, here is x and it will be, here is 1. So this one, it will be, I can say, 6a plus 1 times and minus 6a. And here is this x. Look, 6a, here is minus, this is plus, so it will be 0. And 1 times x, it will be x. So here is plus, this is plus. And in this case, I can see easily. Here is 6a, 6a plus 1 is equal to 0. Then, 
I can say easily it will be x square plus 6a and here is x so I can say easily 6a plus 1 times this x minus 6a x minus 6a 6a plus 1 is equal to 0 then in this case I can see easily here is x square this is minus 6x so this term and this term here is x is common so I can say x so x square divide x it will be x and 6a x divide x it will be minus 6a and in this case I can see easily 6a plus 1 here and here 6a plus 1 is common so 6a plus 1 is common so in this case this divide this it will be x minus this divide this here is 6a is equal to 0 then again I can see easily here is x minus 6a again common so here is x minus 6a and this divide this it will be x and this divide this it will be plus 6a plus 1 is equal to 0 then we will find out here is two case uh, our first case is x minus 6a is equal to 0 and other case we will find out x plus 6a plus 1 is equal to 0 then I can see easily here is x is equal to 6a but remember that a is equal to 1 1 1 so I can see easily x is equal to 6 times 1 1 1 1 it will be 6 6 6 6 so this is our final answer this is the value of x1 and again in this case I can see easily x is equal to minus 6a plus 1 and in this case I can see easily x is equal to minus and we are find out the value of 6a it will be 6 6 6 6 plus 1 remember that a is equal to 1 1 1 1 so I can see easily here is x is equal to minus 6 6 6 7 this is our final answer this is the value of x2 so in this case I can say easily uh, our final answer is uh, x1 is equal to 6 6 6 6 and x2 is equal to 6 6 6 7 so <coughs> it is a quadratic equation so you, you can solve this question this method or if you use calculator you can solve this question this method like you know that x is equal to minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4 is c over 2a if you follow these rules in this case in this math so you can solve this question easily but you can use calculator this method thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel and like this video goodbye take care